News 8, big news for Battle Creek. Kellogg has operated in the city for over a century. They're now announcing they will split into three companies. While it's not expected to affect jobs, it could still have a big impact uh, on the Serial City. News 8's David Horak is live with details. David. Good afternoon, Emily and Tom. The three companies, according to Kellogg's executives, will each focus on different products they are already making. And here they are under temporary names and the products that are umbrellaed under each of them. Global Snacking Company, North America Cereal Company, and Plant Company. Now, each of those names mention the type of product they're overseeing. Global Snacking, which accounts for 80% of Kellogg's net sales at $11.4 billion, that will actually have dual campuses in Battle Creek and Chicago with its headquarters now in the Windy City. Plant and North America Cereal will have their headquarters still remain here in Battle Creek. It's a major shift in identity for Battle Creek where W.K. Kellogg founded the company in the early 1900s. But with this bold new chapter taking on three different names, its current CEO says the Kellogg brand is not expected to fade away given the temporary status. Kellogg tradition has been, you know, around for 116 years now. Mr. Kellogg started this great company. Of course, he didn't know what Pringles was, but he started the cereal business and was a great entrepreneur. And his name will live on in cereal boxes worldwide. And I wouldn't uh, at all dismiss the possibility of one of the businesses carrying on the Kellogg tradition in terms of the corporate name. That's work to be done. But the Kellogg tradition, the Kellogg legacy, the Kellogg philanthropic uh, values will live on in all three companies. So he'll have three companies rather than one company. Executives say the process of divvying up Kellogg's into these three companies are expected to be done by the end of next year. We are still waiting to hear from the city of Battle Creek and the local union for their initial reaction to this massive news. We're live in Battle Creek. David Horak, News 8.